Good morning, uh, welcome to Arthur David. My name is Stephen Shaw, I'm the development chef here. Um, on a day-to-day -day basis, I'm normally working with um, chefs from hotels and restaurants, uh, sourcing produce, um, and liaising with them on, on menus. During these unprecedented times, um, we are working more with the, with the general public through our home deliveries. So I'd just like to take a few minutes to show you some produce um, some seasonal produce which I've sourced today from our fridges and I'm going to do a few dishes. Uh, the reason I've chosen this particular dish is it goes really well with, with roast, um, roast meats like roast lamb um, or even roast beef. Uh, it goes lovely with um, if you wanted to roast some fillet of cod or some poached salmon. It's a really tasty dish. Um, and being it's going to be quite nice this weekend, I thought if you're having a barbecue, do this dish an hour before your barbecue and it will be ready with your charred meats. Um, so like I say, it's very versatile. Um, so what I'm going to do first of all is slice the potato, I've sliced the onion and then I'm going to put some uh, a little bit of uh, chiffonade of um, sage running through it as well. Then with some vegetable stock, just pour over the vegetable stock, then run it through the oven, 180 degrees for roughly an hour, hour and a half. So, if you don't have a mandolin, which I would imagine a lot of you don't, then um, it's, you know, you can always use a knife, as long as it's cut fairly thin, um, you know, it will cook. It may take a little longer, they're not all the same, but um, if, you just, if you just get your potato and just slice it down like so, as long as they're all roughly that same size. So what we're going to do, I've buttered the, the oven proof dish, and all I'm going to do is literally layers of potato, layers of onion so I'm just going to lightly slice the sage you don't want to put too much sage um, it's purely for flavor I mean sage is a very strong herb so just a little bit so all I'm going to do is that much and then I'm going to layer more potato right up, um, potato and onion right to the top and then pour over the stock. So I've laid potato, onion, sage all the way up to the top and I'm just going to put a little bit of vegetable stock. You can make your own vegetable stock um, or we, we sell ready-made stocks at Arthur David um, and they're all perfectly good 